Hey. Welcome back, everybody. Got a bit of a dilemma I need to tell you about. We had a whole bunch of crap happen. <laughs> Let me uh, run over here. Uh, we'll talk about the armor in a minute. Listen to that sound, though, when I'm running. It's new. So notice my last death is now down there. Um, I got back to the base, and I went down there after I got done recording to check for oil. I found it. It's there. So, going forward, that is a viable option. However, uh, I don't know what they've done with the Megalodons, but I got absolutely swarmed and murdered. Uh, twice over. Um... There's, there's so many of them, and, and they, they aggro from such a far distance. It's seriously just jacked up. So, you can go down there and get it. I would not advise doing it without scuba gear. Um, or have a better water mount. Uh, or a good water mount. Something that can get down there and kill things efficiently. Sarcos can swim fast. Uh... They don't, they don't have a very good attack, and I'll show you that in a minute. If you notice, this Sarko is not the same Sarko we had. You can tell by the colors. So anyway, sorry about that. Uh, not the original um, uh, Sarko that we got. Uh, I died, and I actually had to like revert back a bit because I kept trying to change the visual settings after that. If you notice, I'm on a high resolution now. I figured out how to do this with a somewhat stable FPS. Um, get rid of your freaking clouds. That, that helped so much. Uh, there's a there's a command you can put in to uh, get rid of the clouds. Um, can't remember what it is, but if I do remember it, I will let you know. Um, yeah, just quick Google. There's, there's a cloud thing. Uh, I don't know. You just put it in your INI file and set the value to zero. If they're gone. So anyway, um, I had I, we basically lost all of our progress from last night. So I went back over. I retamed another one that was the same level. Um, and here we are. I named it Karen because it's just been giving me problems. Um, we still got Dum Dum. Yeah, it was just a mess last night. But anyway, I don't advise going to get oil down there. Today, I'm going to try to keep this... The, the goal is 20 to 30 minutes for an episode, and I've been really just screwing that. Um, we've been 40 minutes for a few now. Um, I want to show you something. I don't... Okay, I've never I never really messed around with Sarkos in the past. They were not my thing. Um, but look how fast these things are. <laughs> what the hell? Have they always been this fast? Absolutely insane. Anyway, two things we want to accomplish in this video. I need to find an Anki, and I need to find um, a Pteranodon. A flyer is absolutely vital, um, and the Anki is going to be absolutely vital. Um, I've seen two. I don't know where they're at. They're over here. Oh, before we do, I need to I need to make some more tranks. And before I do, man, I tell you, the ADHD gets you. Um, dies, yes, the armor. So... I took the opportunity after I lost all my stuff to upgrade the armor. Went back to the classic colors. I was able to actually do a better blue this time because they added more dyes to the game. Um, I chose these colors because, well, if you know, you know. Keep pounding, baby. Huge Carolina Panther fan. Um, I know they're doing terrible this year. We don't have to talk about it. Man, let me get these out of here because I'm going to make some more um, uh, narcotics. But anyway... Look at all this stuff. You have Azure, you have all these different kinds that you can make now with the cyan berries. All these different shades, your blues. I mean, there's there's a ton of them. That whole grayscale thing going on. Tons of dyes that you can do. Which is pretty awesome. Yeah, so, uh, make some dyes. It's cool. Oh, and then when you have them in your inventory, they just pop some up under this cosmetics tab here. So if you had if you take your armor off, calm down, calm down, everyone. Um, it puts it here for your allowed items, so that's pretty cool. Uh, let me 
let's go ahead and make these narcotics, and then we're gonna go find that Anki. So I got 92 in here. I really didn't need to make more, but um, here we are. But anyway, we need to find. Oh, here he is. 60. I want to see what level the other one is. Uh, important to note, I have went all over this island. I have not been to the Arctic area yet. And I'm by, I, I mean the beach, you know. I went around on the beach. I didn't like actually go to the main side yet. There he is. 100. That's about as good as it's going to get. So, I have yet to see a single thing over. I think I saw an Argentavis that was 140. Um, down on Carnivore Island, or up on Carnivore Island. Uh, haven't seen any max level creatures yet. 90% of the damn things I see are le are level 20 or less. So, very unfortunate. I love the colors of this dude. But no trap needed for this guy. Um, this is a very peaceful island, and I didn't see any Ankies over here that are going to aggro us. So we are just gonna hit him, the tranks, kite him, and hopefully he doesn't hit us when we're close to our guys. Otherwise, Karen is gonna get a little moody. Come do her thing. Uh, Ankies are pretty straightforward. Just knock him out. You know, be super awesome though is finding a family of Ankies so I can get a baby Anki. I really like the wild babies. It's such a cool feature they added. If, if I ran... What if you ran up on a family of level 150? That'd be like the jackpot, right? Like, max level whatever the hell you're trying to get. Like, say, you get max level T-Rexes. You get a male and a female, both 150. And then it has a baby that's 150. Like, that's freaking awesome. I would, I would love that. Another note, I did not find any baby flyers, so I looked at a ton of Argentavis. I didn't see any babies walking around. Kind of expected that. But, um... I mean, it makes sense, right? The wild ones fly around, and the babies... I don't know if you've ever um, read the flyers, but the, the babies do not fly. They just, they just walk around. Carnivore Island seemed a little different. The geography was, was much better, a more natural. Um, maybe on a few, future episode, before we do the cave, we'll probably go back up there. Especially when I start looking for boss dinos. So, still haven't decided if I want to do a Rex. He's out. Or if there's, you know. Um, the sky's the limit. It's, it's really going to be whichever one I find first. Typically tame at about 135 and above. I'm looking for boss dinos. Uh, measure berries. So we want to use measure berries for this. I don't have any veggies. And I don't have any kibble. He's only level 100. I don't. I'm not min maxing this. I, I don't really need him. It's you know, the best. Um, cool thing to note though anywhere on the map that you go, you'll be able to see this taming. Uh, emblem here. Uh, the outside is the torpor, and then in, once he starts eating those berries, you're going to see a yellow bar open up in the middle of us and show you progress. And then if you look at it, anywhere on the map, a little window pops up on the side there and it shows you all the data. So that's pretty cool. I'm glad that's a thing now. Where is Karen? Alright, now while he tames up, that's going to take a hot minute. He's using berries. Keep in mind, we do have a setting to 2.5x. I did see a boatload of pteranodons over here. But when I looked at the spyglass, none of them were the damn. So, we're going in a bit blind with this one. I have no idea. With pteranodons, though, if you, I don't know if you ever tamed one, but... This one's level 100. I, I do not. I don't want it. <laughs> because. Like, stamina and weight is such an important thing with them. And the lower they are. It's just. It's just. It sucks. Like, it's not good. They're not. 
you tell what level he is. Um, unless you've done it, you, it's, it's hard to explain. They can barely even carry you as it is. I, I looked earlier, and I'm pretty, I'm pretty confident none of these are above that level 100 that we saw. And that drop. There's been some crazy movies. Oh, and I dropped through the world earlier. By earlier, I mean like yesterday. Oh yeah, 50, that's awesome. I'm gonna take them, just... I don't, I don't really need this armor. Though they're ammo, so I don't think I can grind them up. And honestly, I'll probably never use them if I can't grind them, but I'm gonna keep them just you know, until I get a grinder. Let's see if I can actually grind those up and get some free metal. But, um, anyway, maybe 100 was not good enough for me. out quick, they can't carry you, and it's, it's not going to do anything. And I can go tame an Argentavis right off the bat. I'm going to need one. Farming later on, especially when uh, I have to go on like a bulk run, get some obsidian or something from Lava Mountain. They're good at killing things too, like Argentavis can do some damage and have like a heal effect whenever they eat stuff. So slow. I'm traveling around with this uh, Sarko is pretty awesome. It's unbelievably fast. And speed is king now that you can't upgrade. Speed. Pelagornis would be worth a damn if it wasn't so slow. The moment I see a 150, I'm gonna go crazy. 150 anything. I don't even care if it's a dodo. 75. I don't recall it ever being this difficult to find a high level creature. And yet, I did not play on the island that much. A lot of my play. Um, I like to. I like. I like stuff like you know Valguero and Ragnarok is my home base or whatever. Hell yeah, 120. Let's do 120. Let's just do this one. Rear before he takes off. Alright, for these guys, what you want to do? Let's fire up the bola, baby. Easy peasy. Two shots to the head should do it. Now, while he's unconscious, we need to go get some prime meat. Which is so easy to do now. <laughs> all we need is a baby. These things are not fast on land at all. Which is bullcrap, because alligators are super fast on land. According to the Google. Look it up. Like, they're, like, as fast as horses. Most likely catch me. Ah, oh, that thing's gonna get my raptor while we're looking. Cross your fingers, everyone. All we need is a baby. All we need is a baby. There are some uh, chests over here. I don't think I'm gonna waste it on the Sarko.
debris on this chunk, this area. Oh, I saw the thing. You saw that? That was the symbol of it being a parent. Ooh. See? Got the little heart thing. I guess that means it's a parent. Oh, where'd it go? I heard it. There it is. Oh, Gary. You don't like children, do you? Circles are terrible. Like the, their attack is like, ugh. Barely hit anything. Now I don't know where the body's at. Where is the body at? Dude. So stupid. Oh, Karen found it, I guess. Hey, we got four. Four should be plenty. Um, oh, something, I don't, I, like I said, I don't play Sarkos. If you hold shift, look behind you, click, it snaps. Behind you. Attack. I thought it was pretty good. I have no idea what this attack does. I think I did it on, uh, one of those little trilobites. I did it on a trilobite and kept it in my mouth. But he spits it out right away. Um, I can't tell how much damage it does. It's not. Okay, so where is the... I see the Anki, but where's... Where's the, uh... Where's Pranathon? Did we already lose him? Did something kill him? Bro! Oh, he's alive. Oh. Is he? He's alive. Why is he not popping up on our tracking thing? Stats, 390 stamina, 423% melee. Only 175 weight, though. Not that good. So, we're going to have him follow us back to base. I'm going to get the saddle on him. We're going to take it for a spin. He should be able to keep up. Karen. Karen's like a world-class swimmer, but... Man, look at this, look at this bad boy. I 
don't know. The, I know there's like at least one or two up in here. I don't quite remember the location of them. There was always one on the left side. Run up here. Kind of like next to one of these rocks by the beach. And there was one towards the middle of the island. See the ruins over there to my right? So there's going to be one in there. But I always remember one near the beach. And then another one on the opposite side on that beach. Suck it. Suck it remembering things like this. And, I mean, looking up the Ark Survival of Vive, Survival of Survival Evolved, uh... Explorer Note map is not quite going... That was laggy as hell. Going to give me what I need. Because... It's just going to tell me the general area of how the map looked before. And it's still relatively the same, but... There it is. There's one. Now let me check my stats. Or I waste that. I can't wait. Here we go. Okay. I need to eat. Um... It's to me too. Got 12. Put that weight. And then... I'm probably not going to be using this guy too much to kill things. Um... Let's just do it. I have an urgent need for this guy to be good, so... Do a couple more stamina. One for health for good luck, I guess. I believe as melee as it is. Risk of weight. All right. Yep. Let's see how long one shot of uh, flying the sprint on would get. How far? Away. No C roll. Uh, I immediately noticed when I got this guy. Stamina drain is not as much as it used to be. I think they improved that a little bit. Also, it would be crazy. I should probably stop making statements <laughs> about my feelings and what I, what I think is happening without fact checking it first. But tough shit, then it wouldn't be the internet. I think he's done. So let's get on back to the base and check him out. Patch notes that came out today that said uh, something about responses or input with uh, using different resolutions than your native resolution. Um, I was definitely noticing that before, but I have it set to 4K right now, and I have a native native resolution of 4K on my monitor, and this having some uh, issues with. Sometimes I'll try to do a command and it won't work, such as landing. That may not be the same problem that uh, people were having, but they patched. God, I love the colors of that dude. Um, let me get hide. Let's hide on him. Get that. I know you got hide, Karen. You always got hide. Hey, you dirty girl. Isn't she, though? She's just filthy. Yeah. Is the Anki saddle here? Yes, it is. What do I need? I need some fiber and some hid. There's the fiber. Throw those in here. I just need a bunch of fiber. I said fiber. I put the hide in there, not the fiber. Right, I'm gonna do it. Let's do it. I'm just gonna make a sickle real quick. Just to see. Uh, I didn't learn it, did I? Where is it? Uh, okay. Where? Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. I, I'm curious if this will work on the grass. I don't ever make these. It's not something that I 
really ever made. Because fiber, I guess long term, has always just been something. Uh, Hell yeah, look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at all that fiber. I don't have great strength for harvesting at all. Well, I think we got enough fiber to last us until extinction comes out. <laughs> Uh, anyway, the, um, uh, gotchas that come out in Extinction, like, I used to feed them a ton of fiber. When I would play on public servers with, like, you know, like tons of mods, um, you could get the, basically, gotcha towers or whatever. I forgot what the things were called, but the platforms you put them on and you wouldn't get the penalty. It's pretty cool. Okay. Um... Go here and untrack all of that stuff. Awesome. Oh yeah, you're so slow. So right click bites the bushes. I wanna say cattails. If I run into any cattails, this dude will uh get uh rare flowers. I'm pretty sure it's the rare flowers though. Tons of rare flowers. You know, if you want to bring Anki to the swamp or something. But with how dense the foliage is now, I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna break these rocks because there used to be a um, metal here. Last death thing. Where is it? I don't want to remember. But it's gonna keep showing more to me every time I'm going on. Yeah, here we go. There's some metal dust. Man, his weight's already full. That's gonna be a problem, dude. Curious if these guys swing on their own. I know, like, the Dodicarus will swing on its own. Wow, he got a lot of berries, didn't he? I need all those. I need that. I need these. I'm gonna drop the rest. Those narcos. What is it? Is he the one? Does he... Where's his weight at? 312. This was 123. Notice how the weight went down when I put it on him. So they get a weight reduction for those. No weight reduction for that. No weight reduction for that. But they get it for metal. Um, Argentavis also has some weight reduction for various things. Getting trees with this guy... It's like swinging a giant pig, essentially. But we need him for metal. We need a boatload of it. An entire boat, people. Okay, okay, yeah. Come on. After you level them up, they gotta do the thing, you know. A couple more, then we'll eat this dude off the cliff back to the base. Yeah, anyway, the uh, Dodicarus you can pick up with an Argentavis. It's fly by rocks, and he will swing on the rocks naturally without anybody having to help you. You have a buddy, you can have your buddy ride on the Yankee while you ride on the Argentavis. Pick up the Yankee when he's on it, fly around, and he can swing. Before the Yankee and Ark would not swing on anything naturally like the Dodicarus did, so. metal node, baby. One more metal node. There we go. So slow. Oh, he's so slow. Oh, never gonna make it. And... Okay. 200. That's a good start. Go ahead and hop off him. Follow me, buddy. Watch him not even jump. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Okay, so that's still a thing. That really hurt me, though. 
Thanks for watching, and uh, next time, we can uh, maybe go get some beaver dams or something. But uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thank you. Yeah.